Sup guys, Juggalo here. You want to know what's so great about living in an apartment? Getting woken up at 6.15 in the morning while the neighbors are arguing and it's your day off. But anyways, going on to some news that I have been waiting for for a while. And it is about the X79 and the PCI Express compatibility. Now as you guys know, um, they said oh, X79 supports 3.0 and... NVIDIA didn't really have any patches for it, or it wasn't even really supported in their drivers. The way to do that, back in the day, was to do a registry hack to enable 3.0. And there's some big gains that you can get from PCI Express 3.0, especially if you're running four GTX 680s and you're using surround. So that bandwidth is definitely helpful compared to PCI Express 2.0. So, that being said, I have some news. NVIDIA has released a patch, and I am trying to mute my phone in the process. So, sorry about that. But anyway, I'm going to go to this article that I pulled up, and I'll have the article right underneath the description box, as always, so you can read it. But I am going to read what this says and everything and try to explain uh, why they did it. Okay? Now, let me go ahead and minimize my webcam deal. All right, G4 600 series Gen 3 support on X79 platform. And I'm going to read the whole thing for you guys just because I'm nice like that. G4's GTX 680 and GTX 670 support PCI Express 3.0. They operate properly within the SIG PCI Express specification and have been validated on multiple PCI Express 3.0 platforms. Some motherboard manufacturers have released an updated S BIOS to enable X79 PCI Express 2.0 platform to run up to AGT, which is PCI Express 3.0. We have tested the GTX 680 and 670 across a number of X79 platforms at 8 GT speeds, but have seen significant variation in signal timing across different motherboards and CPUs. So basically um, they're not given full support is because the frequencies as I stated they're bouncing off the walls on the different uh, motherboards and they couldn't have a set standard so they weren't sure if it would work on other motherboards if they released uh, the supported 3.0. Okay Therefore, we decided only to support and guarantee PCI Express 2.0 bus speeds on X79 with our standard drivers. That's why you see when the newer drivers come out, we don't see uh, a 3.0 increase on X79, or I should say 3.0 being enabled on X79 motherboards. It's only going to be enabled with native PCI Express platforms like Ivy Bridge that will run at 8 GT speeds with their standard drivers. Alright, now it's going to go on to say, though we cannot officially support or guarantee 8 GT speeds for X79, you can manually enable faster 8 GT bus speeds, but it's going to be at your own risk, okay? on GTX 680 or 670 GPUs using the following executable is the name of the file if you would like to revert back to 5GT bus speeds you can do by doing uh, basically you're gonna do a command uh, DOS line and it's gonna be force tack enable tack gen 3 tack or I should say decimal exe tech revert again I'll have this in the link description and everything like that so it does have a file download you download that if you want to enable PCI Express 3.0 on your X79 board and it is at your own risk I have known about this since yesterday around two o'clock when I got to work and everything but I was busy with work so I couldn't really make a video and I uh, hope this helps you out on people who are having, uh, or I should say, are using the X79 motherboards. And uh, 
I hope this video is helpful for you guys, a little more understanding of why they didn't do it. And as always, comment, subscribe, rate this video, click that like button. You guys have a great day.